studio and I said, can you just try a piano? And he wanted to strangle me and we were fighting about it. But the piano kind of became Parker's voice in the, in the movie. And once, once he tried the piano, it, it, it did work. But um, he's, 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 he's almost there. He's almost there. Um, right here? Um, yeah, uh, the number in the movie, if I were to dial that, would I get right here or something? Actually, you would get Riley as Shannon. Um, this is one of one of the first movies where it's not a five 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 number because it, because it was such an important set piece that they keep saying the phone number over and over again. The five 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 thing because every time you see it or hear it in a movie, you're just like, oh god, I'm watching a movie. So what we did is we actually bought a phone number that we own for the next forty years. Um, with the in the Boston area, we're not supposed to say what the area code is, but if you try enough area codes and get that number, you will get uh, Riley's voice saying, I agree, Shannon, uh, leave a message. So we're actually looking forward to seeing what people have to say um, when the movie opens. <laughs> it's going to be pretty funny. Um, let's see, one more. I thought there was another hand up. Maybe, no, they were just scratching. Okay. Uh, oh, sorry, right up there. <coughs> Um, thank you. Um, it's in about four different theaters right here in Salt Lake City. I don't have them on me, but if you check your local listings, you'll find it. Um, again, I know this sounds like I'm pouring myself out here, but it was so important to me that they pick Salt Lake City because they usually don't for limited releases, and I guarantee them. I'm like, trust me, they will show up and they'll support it. But if, if we get a good per screen average next weekend, they're prepared to blow it out wide. They're scared of the wolf man though, unfortunately. And I mean, when you have a movie that's been on the shelf for a year and a half, I don't think we should really be that scared. They're two very different things. Um, and I think with things like Paranormal Activity, it showed that there is still an audience for original stuff. It doesn't have to be a remake. So if you did like the movie, um, or even if you didn't and you just kind of like us, um, please, everything you can, spread the word, try to get people to come back uh, and buy tickets so that we can open it wider. Um, thank you guys so very much for coming.